In this video, you will learn how to design an edentulous surgical guide with the Three Shape Implant Studio. At the Surgical Guide step, you can design a surgical guide based on your implant planning. The initial guide will be generated automatically and is based on the denture scan and the implant planning. You can change the height and diameter of the sleeve support cylinders by dragging the green control handle around the cylinder. Under two-piece guide options, you can split the guide into two separate pieces by clicking the Enable Disabled Two-Piece Surgical Guide button. After enabling the two-piece guide option, it may be necessary to adjust the sleeve support cylinders using the green control points. If needed, add glue channels to the sleeve support cylinders by clicking the Add Glue Channels button. By clicking the Select Sleeve button, you will open up the sleeve selector, where you can choose between different sleeve types. At the Modify Fixation sub-step, you can remove excessive material on the fixation piece of the guide if needed. Click the green Add icon to mark the area you want to remove. Press and hold Shift and scroll the mouse wheel to change the diameter of the sphere to modify the area of removal. To delete the marked area, click the red Remove icon or the red Remove All icon. Click Preview to see the result when you are done marking. On the ID Tag substeps, you can add ID tags to both surgical guide pieces. You can change the default ID tag by typing in the ID tag text field. Move the mouse cursor over the guide and move the ID tag to where you wish to place it. Left click the guide to place the ID tag. Click the Invert ID tag button to invert it. When the guide design is finalized, click Next to proceed to the Save step. Preview the surgical report before approval by clicking the Show Surgical Report button. If you are satisfied with it, you can proceed to the approvals. You can approve the implant planning and surgical guide individually. Click the corresponding checkboxes for approval. A warning message will appear informing you that after the approval, you will not be able to edit the implant planning or the surgical guide. Click Yes if you agree and wish to proceed. A drill protocol will be generated after you approve the case. The order will be saved and the output will be generated. You can navigate directly to the output folder by clicking the Open Save Folder button. This includes the drilling protocol, the surgical report, and the STL file of the guide. After the case has been approved and saved, you are only able to review the planning and the guide. Click Next to save the results and return to the patient or case manager. You have now prepared a case for an endentulous patient. Thank you for watching.